In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to change paper size in WPS Office in mobile phone. So first of all, what you need to do is that you want to open WPS Office. So click on it to open it. And once you open your WPS Office, you want to open the document that you want to change the paper size. So I'm just going to open my document, which is the one at the top right here. So as you can see, my document is opened. So now in order for us to change the paper size for our document, what we just need to do is that we want to go ahead and click on the menu right here, which is on the bottom left corner so click on the menu and once you click on the menu this is going to take you on this page that you're looking at right now so once you come right here you want to scroll this whole section to the left like this as you can see and basically you want to go ahead and click on view and once you click on view you're going to see these options that are at the bottom right here so you just need to scroll it to the bottom like this and basically you're going to see an option under view which says page setup so click on that particular option and this is going to bring you on this particular page on page setup where we can now go ahead and change our paper size or our page size. So in order for us to do that, we just need to go right here on page size and basically go ahead and click on this arrow, which is pointing to the downside. And right here, you'll be able to see different paper sizes or page size that you can choose from. So then, for example, let's say we want to switch into B5. You just need to tap on it like this and then basically go ahead and click on OK. And as you can see right here, our document has actually changed to B5 size. So if you want to change it once again to another size, we just need to come right here once again and click right here on this arrow. Let's say we want to choose A3. We just need to choose A3 like this and basically click on OK. And as you can see, our document has actually increased in size and it's now A3. So as for me, I'm just going to go back and click on page setup and basically leave it on a4 like this and basically click on ok 